What's good, future millionaires? We back with another banger. So we got a Volted update today. Some major news that I know my community will be excited to hear. So first off, join the fam if you already haven't. Hit that subscribe button, turn on notifications. Also check the links in the description section of this video. Now, let's check out what's going on with Volt Inu. So we got a few you know, uh, hints here at already what took place. Coinbase says, I'm going to pay my Thirsty Thursday bill with blank tonight. Name the coin slash token. And then we get an update from KuCoin saying, get ready for an electrifying KuCoin fireside chat featuring Vo Inu as we dive into the exciting world of meme coins. This is why it's important when you see, you know, the community rallying to get the attention of certain exchanges. You want to participate with a like, with a share. That engagement is important because these profiles of these major exchanges, they have social media managers who do see, you know, which tokens are the strongest or have the best communities and they're going to take note and look into it so uh it looks like that's what kucoin has done with vote inu with the official vote inu listing on kucoin you heard it y'all it is official so good morning to all the vote to chaz and chat ants it's about to vote also shout out to jake holding it down on the front lines Votoshi says vote it and then you see in the stage five of the roadmap it says three top 10 centralized exchanges this is letting us know that we are getting closer as KuCoin, as Vo Inu, most likely some of these other top exchanges are going to take note and we could be seeing future listings on those top three. So uh, I believe Atoshi said KuCoin is voted number four largest crypto exchange voted by or you know put together by coin market cap if i'm not mistaken but we'll see that post but vatoshi shared a meme saying i sold vote at the bottom because it was zero tax that was a time where you know a lot of people you know basically said you know how is this project going to be able to sustain itself moving to a zero tax some people you know are excited being able to buy more vote for a cheaper price but the tier one started accumulating and listing vote because it's voted and zero tax so strong community zero tax allowing more opportunities to get listed on some of these exchanges that aren't comfortable with that tax so also vatoshi says usdt market cap reaching a new all-time high the u.s debt ceiling bill getting passed hong kong allowing retail trading of crypto kucoin the number four centralized exchange in the world flirting with and holding vote vote to times to say the least so you see that purchase from KuCoin go uh, through first. Normally, uh, we can just connect dots and say, when we see uh, exchange purchase a large amount of a token that isn't already on that exchange, we can assume there is a future listing coming. That's exactly what we've seen happen with KuCoin. Somebody mentioned it being on the, uh, is showing up on the Ether scan, and you know, uh, we can now confirm that it is official. So USDT market cap reaching all reaching a new high. You know, as people lose faith in the actual dollar. And realize that you know holding money in u.s currency is just not you know um uh, the the secure thing to do anymore it's not like it was you know uh 20 30 years ago when the u.s dollar was you know i'm not even sure exactly how strong it was at that point but just we were uh, uh our country had more faith from other countries we were you know used as when it comes to businesses or international uh transactions and things like that they use the u.s dollar now we're seeing more and more countries step away from the u.s dollar i believe right now um uh, the Chinese yen is the number one use uh, currency when it comes to foreign transactions or, you know, business deals from different countries and things like that. So it's crazy to see, you know, and now as people see that taking place, that uh, that faith diminishing, people realize that they need to move their money to somewhere safer. And that's why USDT, you know, is picking up right now. Also, the uh, Congress just voted on getting this uh, bill passed to raise the debt ceiling, basically meaning that, you know, the Federal Reserve will turn the money printers back on so more money will be pumped into the economy usually when we see that happen we get closer to bull markets you know uh bull market activity people become more bullish people start buying more and you know we start to see you know some uh some good times so uh also hong kong just allow retail trading this is something that's extremely massive i heard someone mention this you know uh tracking china can be the end of the bear market and tracking China, you can also kind of connect the dots sometimes on the beginning of a bull market. So remember, when China banned crypto trading in 2021, that was basically the mark of the bear. Uh, that was where the point of the bear market started when everything began to drop. And it's been like that since, you know, that time period. And now we're getting China, Hong Kong specifically, allowing retail trading now. So this can be, you know, that lever being flipped back on to, you know, allow that bull market to, you know, start to, 
actually uh, come this way. Now, we do have a lot of exchanges that collapsed over the last few months. So, you know, we are in that crypto winter time. But good news like Hong Kong allowing retail trading can help reverse some of that damage we've seen as people become more bullish. So, uh, super uh, excited about this, to be honest, y'all. KuCoin is major. But especially at this time, you know, um, when we start seeing major institutions make moves, you want to pay attention because they know something. They're not just, you know, buying... Uh, hundreds of thousands millions of dollars worth of tokens and they don't you don't have any faith in the project so keep that in mind but Fatoshi says a vaulted article from our partner at xp network on our vdsc nfts and the eth bsc bridge they created for them the future is multi-chain and so are our vaulted dragons time to open the portal so something coming with the vdsc nft collection stay tuned for that uh Fatoshi says me watching the vaulted run begin and then also a partnership that I, uh, you know, interesting. I like to see, you know, these partnerships, these collaborations with these new projects that are actually, you know, gaining a lot of attention right now. So this is uh, not saying I'm endorsing this project. You got to remember, this video is not financial advice, not telling you to buy, sell or hold any of these projects. But I like to see that collaboration between, you know, uh, hot meme coins and Vote Inu. You know, Vote Inu really, you know, taking that uh, memes, meme coin spirit. And really riding on it not shying away from it you know as we've seen some projects start off as meme coins and then eventually they you know uh don't want to be considered that anymore but vote Inu, you know building utility and still thriving as an actual meme coin so like to see that as well shout out to y'all reaching out to the channel i will tap in with y'all as soon as this video is over but a retweet over here Oh, no, that's, that's a comment. So, voted to see our deflationary ecosystem growing, our supply getting burned, and the voltage change adoption growing by the day. Glad to welcome three new projects that integrated our widget in the last few days, thus offering an easy way to buy from their website while burning, while burning the supply at the same time. So I think it's over maybe 170 plus projects right now using the voltage change widget, you know, and this is going to continue to grow. Vatoshi, you know, snap with these utilities because not only is it providing value for the vote army, it's providing value for the crypto ecosystem. And that's what we really need in order for a project to have some solid utility. So something maybe voting, Vatoshi says, with a uh, vote trending on Dex tools, it looks like at hot number one. Vatoshi says, how crazy would it be to see tier one start listing vote less than three weeks after the migration to a zero tax token that was supposed to be the end of vote? And then shout out to Space Chick holding it down with the uh, Space Cabin. Also, Ladybug as well with Lady Knights. Y'all go show them some support. Make sure y'all subscribe, follow them and everything. Also, shout out to Believes. He said every breakout starts with a trend, and the trend appears to be reversing back to money inflows on vote. At this point, to really grab attention, the vote army needs to see strong buys up to seven, up to that 7,000 uh, points per coin level and then a breakthrough to support there. Resistance at 10,000 is obviously the key. I think it's gonna say resistance level. So the key, oh, the key is the key. Drop the zero and vote is your hero. So shout out to Bleeds. Make sure y'all go subscribe, follow him as well. Show him some love. He's in the vote army. But Toshi says the vote army is everywhere. Vote will be everywhere. Then waiting for space, forgetting the beer comes first. So just, you know, uh, a lot of excitement right now during this time. You see a ton of uh, influencers right now. You know, always Vote has, you know, people supporting the community. But especially this is something that we were all waiting for. So this is really good to see right now. Shout out to Hina Crypto. Uh, Vatoshi says, you don't want to sleep anymore. You want to vote. Make sure y'all go follow and subscribe to Hina Crypto as well. Uh, I'm not sure if he has a YouTube channel, but I know he's on Twitter. So y'all go show some love. Also, shout out to Jake. Make sure y'all go follow, subscribe to him. He says, huge congrats to the vote Inu for getting listed on KuCoin. And uh, also, Hinox said, think about this. Of all the projects that could have hosted a meme coin conversation with a top exchange, vote Inu was the one. Big summer ahead. He has a point there, y'all. And then Pablo, shout out to him. He says, emergency live, vote KuCoin, 11.45 p.m. Eastern time before the KuCoin Twitter space, meme coin, crypto, trending. So make sure y'all go follow uh, Pablo. Also subscribe to him as well. Show him some love. One of the Vote Inu generals holding it down on the front lines. Then we got Vatoshi saying, the Vote Army is spreading the voltage everywhere, trending on both ETH and BSC. And then huge news for Vote Gang. We are getting listed on KuCoin, says Teddy. Y'all go show him some love. Follow him. Shout out to Blackbeard. Make sure y'all follow him as well. He says, finally, Vote getting Vaulted on KuCoin. Next stop, Binance. Who is next? Who do y'all think is next? Drop in the comment section. Let me know who you think would be next. We got to look at the top exchanges. Uh, Crypto Tony says a big listing coming for Vote Inu. 
None of the game. Cool coin, shout out to him. Go follow him. And then Vatoshi says 20 plus million users are about to be able to vote with KuCoin. Listing vote in a few hours. KuCoin celebrates 20 million registered users with massive trading competition details. Uh, I believe there's also a, a vote Inu competition going on as well. But KuCoin and vote is time to vote the world. And all of a sudden they will want to vote, says Vatoshi. Then another post from Hinox said, I told you KuCoin was coming. I specifically told you in advance precisely what I knew was coming for Vote Inu, and the time has come. But Toshi delivered again, and the Vote Army is jacked. But wait, there's more coming. So, you know, Vatoshi never stops. Always something new in the pipeline for Vote Inu. You know, it's only a matter of time, I truly feel, before, you know, this project. Maybe the bull market might set Vote Inu off, or, you know, Vote Inu just hits a certain point where people recognize the value that's inside of it and, you know, uh, flock to the project. So, the liquid, and remember, this is not financial advice. You gotta, you know, say that just for anybody who uh, takes this as, you know, I'm gonna go put my life savings in it or something like that. Only risk what you're willing to lose. Be wise with your investments. Don't invest off of just what I'm saying. Do your own due diligence. And Vatoshi says the liquidity, credibility, connections, institutions, whales, and amount of users that KuCoin brings to vote cannot be underestimated. And then Vote Inu Landing Party, $40,000 in vote to be won. Absolutely massive competition right there. Y'all go take a part of that. Uh, also, uh, it'll be interesting to see, uh, you know, what this competition actually uh pertains to or you know how you how we go about it because Volti Eco, you know, being uh you know almost ready, I think it's as portions of it is out, but I'm not sure if the airdrop version is out where it could participate in these different, you know, contests or, you know, uh different giveaways. But that would be interesting to be able to get some of that forty thousand back into the vote army. But vote is now officially listed on KuCoin. Trading is live. KuCoin.com slash trade slash vote dash usdt so you will need usdt to buy some over there keep that in mind if kucoin the number four centralized exchange in the world according to cmc is voting how long will it take for the others to do it as well so we can see kucoin kraken coinbase and then binance i have to say kraken most likely next because uh, you know either kraken or coinbase because coinbase will you know uh coinbase is usually a little strict also Binance as well, but Coinbase, you know, I have seen them, you know, with a massive amount of community support, they will list a token. Just for instance, what happened with Shiba Inu, Dogecoin, and, you know, um, ApeCoin, a few others. But I believe either Kraken or Coinbase, it would be crazy if Binance did because I believe that would just, you know, uh, make the other two automatically want to list it. But taking the voltage to a whole different lead. Then we got a video here. <laughs> The People's Crypto will get listed on the People's Exchange today. The voltage never stops. The People's Crypto is voting once again. KuCoin is about to get voted. Actually, let me turn off the music because it might get copyrighted. Voting on KuCoin. So now available for trading. Make sure y'all, you know, if y'all are using KuCoin and you want to support the vote army, you go grab some vote over there. Not telling you to, but, you know, if you're already in the market to grab some and you want to support us and, you know, get that volume up on KuCoin so that other exchanges may potentially want to list us as well, then that would be cool. But uh, that's our update for this one. Shout out to Mike the Investor. Make sure y'all go follow him as well. Show him some love. And then uh, vote. Vatoshi says being bullish today means being bearish tomorrow. Being voltish is forever. And then when you think you've done a lot but actually barely started, vote on KuCoin. Check. Vote on OKX. Not yet. Binance, Coinbase, Kraken, Bybit, Bitsamp, Gemini, Crypto.com, and Robinhood. That would be absolutely crazy to see Vote Inu on Robinhood. But shout out to Che. He says, according to CMC, Vote is ranked one, number 116 by volume and 24 hours out of all 10,343 cryptos. When will Vote break the top 100? Who knows? One thing is certain. Voting to the tippity top. So we got that massive update. That's our vote Inu update for today. We can check out the price and how it is responding at the moment.
We can actually, actually, I want to go on Coin Market Cap so we can look at the overall crypto market at the same time. Overall crypto market sitting at 1.15 trillion. So basically, same where we were yesterday. It's trading sideways. Bitcoin 27, ETH 1898, BNB 305, Doge 7 cent, Sheeb at that 8573 level. So nothing really up today. More than you know around 1.8 percent, except for Tron for some reason up 10.5 percent. But Vol Enu, let's see. So we got Volt right now at back up to that 6302 level down slightly. Now that uh news took place about 20 hours ago, so obviously we were pumping right after that. Uh but down about 3% right now in the last day. So just seeing a slight retracement from that good news that we seen. So, you know, that's our update right now. We're going to continue to watch Volt Enu, see how things roll out. You know, I'm bullish. Let me know in the comment section how y'all feel about Volt Enu. And that's all we got, man. Reach out to me if you're interested in taking your investment education to that next level. I got my stock options trading course, crypto one on one course, and my technical analysis course. If there's somebody who wants to learn how to trade options, my course got you covered. Also, if you're interested in learning technical analysis, if you're someone that doesn't understand the charts, doesn't know how to use indicators, tools, uh, chart patterns, how to put it all together, knowing entries, exits, this course is for you. Reach out to me via email, decemberdemarco at gmail.com. Also, right now, you can pre-order the meme coin course, decemberdemarco at gmail.com. Appreciate y'all for pulling up, and we are out.